Tarot's. Thanks for joining the Small Tarot. Thanks for being here, my 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 beautiful subscribers. If you're new here, please go on ahead and hit that subscribe button. I would love for you to join the family of Just Smile, okay? Um, do, 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 do. I got a lot to do, get done here. This is going to be for Taurus again. We got uh, more reading for Taurus, okay? I feel called to do a reading. Some of you are needing it, all right? Now understand this is not going to resonate with every single Taurian. So if you need a personal reading, you may hit up my inbox. If you don't feel that I'm the reader for you to do a personal, please look at all the other readers on the platform. They are very, very beautiful people, okay? Awesome sauce. All right, um, if you do need anything, it's down in the description box. Donations, understand how my emergency readings work, okay? When you schedule an emergency reading, that means I put everything down and I do your reading. I have a way of getting my children to be kept the eye on and all that stuff, and I get down to your reading, you will have it less than an hour, two at the max. Um, if you don't schedule um, an emergency reading is just a regular personal reading, just a general love reading for yourself, not general, but a private love reading for yourself. You will have to eventually wait for an, a, a day to two days. Um, I, I wish I can do something better, but I, I would have to get, you know, it, it takes extra for me to get everything settled up, okay, to like get everything going around and stuff. Some people need emergency readings and some do not. So please understand that, the difference between the two. Um... So there you go. If you're a Taurus and you just feel like being a Taurus or you know a Taurus or you're crosswalking for a Taurus, you're welcome to be here. Please do not get upset if you feel that this is not your energy, okay? Just don't take it. If it's not yours, don't take it. Remember, there could be a Taurus that's doing this to you, so please be aware of that. But this is a reading for Taurus, okay? Another reading, my dear Taurus, is yes, another reading, okay? All right, what's coming out here? All I miss is within you, Okay? So somebody need to tell you, Taurus, all that they miss is within you. Everything that you are, everything that you, um, you know, do, it's all within you. This person's missing you. Okay, so, you know, um, they might be around people that they just do not even want to be around, but they're missing you, Taurus, okay? They're missing you a lot, okay? That's exactly what I'm getting the vibes off that card. Spirit, what else do we have here for Taurus? This is a thin deck at the time, okay? Because I do got to finish these cards, but I really wanted to, I really wanted to use them. Spirit, what else do we have here for Taurus? Okay, every all I miss is within you. Oh wow. Okay, Taurus, somebody here is regret, and they're in regret. Yep, they talked a lot of shit. They thought they were gonna be about the shit. Okay, to you from, so you will know who this person is. Okay, Taurus, to you, Taurus from. Whoever it may be is missing you, okay? Someone wants to send you a gift. Someone wants to, okay, maybe not a gift, maybe a gift, oh, but oh, I'm getting here strongly, a message. Someone wants to send you a message from da-da-da-da. You, know you know how to fit that in. Broke and nobody knows it but me, okay? Hmm. Somebody's really out of money here, Taurus, so, okay, all right. Oh, man, all right, here we go. Taurus, please don't start getting upset. This is, this is gonna come out to the same message. I'm just feeling it. You know, I put sweet cards in, in my decks, and then it's just like, you know, whatever energy's there, that's the energy that I pick up. And people have the nerve of thumbs down, like, what the fuck do you expect me to do here? I, I, I don't get this. I don't get it, okay? You always shine so bright. Okay, there's something else nice. You always shine so bright, Taurus. Somebody's missing everything that's within you they miss. Okay, you're very calm. You're very sweet. You're very loving. You're very kind, giving. Okay, who wouldn't want that? But somebody here is now broke, and now they're seeing, well, damn, Taurus would have had my back if I would have stick with Taurus. Okay, I send negative energy to you, and wow. Okay, so to you, from someone's wanting to send negative energy. They're sending it your way. They miss you, okay? You always shine so bright, and they can't, this person won't admit this to you, Taurus, but you always shine so bright, and they're sending you negative energy, and you'll know who this is from. You fill in the blank, okay? I knew this was going to turn into something crazy, okay? Um, I only need you in my life. I only need you in my life. Yeah, someone sent a negative energy to try to fuck up all your connections and all the great, the great things you have coming, Taurus, because they are are lacking, okay? Now that the party's done jumping, wherever the party was, was at, where they assumed to be better, it's not going that way anymore. And so they're needing you, and they're sending negative energy to you and whatever else they're doing, Okay? you basically fill in these blanks here because it can go for it's a for a vast amount of people it is a general too much too soon so taurus i think that you gave this person too much too soon and now you're starting to realize it 
All I miss is within you. You always shine so bright. Too much too soon. You gave this person way too much. Way too much of you before you had the chance to actually fill this person out for who they are. But please understand, Taurus, I feel here the most high God, okay, whoever you believe in, all right, they had all this happen for a reason. They did. They had to separate you from this person. Whatever this person's doing and whatever this missing and you're shining so bright and you gave too much too soon, this person's supposed to be learning a lesson and I don't think that they learned it. They're still trying to send negative energy your way. Even when you were with this person, all I miss is within you. To you, from, and then broke, and nobody knows it but me. So this person tries to put on this big old huge show for everybody that they all have it. They have it all. They don't have it all, Taurus, okay? They don't have it all. Spirit, what else do you have here for our dear Taurians, okay? Anything else? Any more messages for my dear Taurus's spirit? Anything else here? Two more cards, at least, Spirit. Two more cards. Two more. Yeah, Taurus, you're dealing with somebody here that's uh, upset because you moved your energy away. You moved your energy away, and you're just not... <laughs> You've grown. From, you've outgrown this person. You've outgrown this person. Yeah, that poker face that they got on. Oh, please do not believe that motherfucker because it's a cheat. Okay? <laughs> They're not happy. You shine so bright. You always shine so bright. Yeah, they see that you always shine so bright, but they didn't really know how bright you shine until you removed yourself from them. Okay? People will forget. They'll neglect the ones that are basically there for them and down for them, but then feed energy and love to the ones that don't give two fucks. And then when that party goes out, when that well runs dry, here they come looking for the brightest thing ever. Now this person's starting to realize how much you treated them, how much you did love, how much did you, how much you did care for them. Okay, and they're not, they're not going to sit there and take and say, okay, I, I see it now. You know, you were. This person has a fucking ego. They have a big chip on their shoulder and that chip is going to fucking stay there for a long time because now they want to send you negative energy. You always shine so bright. They don't like the fact that you shine better than they do. They don't like that you shine brighter than they do. They're so negative and now they're broke and the party's not going anywhere. The party is done. Like, you know, last call for alcohol and I only need you in my life. Now they're... I'm, I'm, I'm broke and nobody knows about me. Now, I only need you in my life. No, Taurus. Uh-uh. Blown away the ashes. Yeah, blown away the ashes, okay? What this what this specific card actually means is that all the hurt, Taurus, that you dealt with, all this negative energy this person sent into you, you blow it right back. You blow it right back. It comes to you in full fold, how they want it. They It comes in a big, pretty, pretty, pretty box with a bow on it, and then it comes, it's delivered to you, and you just blow it away. It turns right into ashes. Why? Because you are protected. It doesn't do anything to you. So whatever this person's trying to send your way, they might as well go on ahead and put it and hang it up. New love wants to add to you. Look at this. Look, now this person's broke. They they see that I only need you in my life, Taurus. New love wants to add to you. Look at that, Taurus. That's absolutely beautiful. So somebody here seeing that something new is being added to you. Someone's wanted to actually put in the work, the effort, and they want to send negative energy from them, from them to to you from whoever this is wants to send negative energy. This could be a family member, this could be family, friends, exes, whatever it is. Blown away the ashes. It's blown, blow away the ashes. That's what you're going to do. Blow away all that old junk. All of it. You don't need it. It's ash. What do you do with it? When you touch ash you have in your hand, when you do, you crumble it. What happens? It dissolves. It's done. Yeah. And you gave this person too much too soon. But I think Spirit had a way. I, have, I think they had a reason for that, Taurus. I think they had a reason for that, okay? So let me get out some of these. Um, some of my uh, made cards here. Yeah, as I split the deck, we got hater. Stop blaming one another. It wasn't meant to stay. Look further. So, course, whether for some of you, you might be blaming this person for what they've done, okay? And they might be do that blame. And this person might be also blaming you. But Spirit's saying, cut the shit. <laughs> it just wasn't meant to be. It wasn't meant to stay together. It wasn't. You got somebody that's, um, that's missing, you know, all I miss is within you. So this person is actually trying to send you negative energy to break you down from other things that you got going on in your life because you keep blowing them away. Whether you're doing it physically, mentally, or telepathically, you're getting rid of this person. You're pushing them out of your life. You're birthing something new and they're broke and no one knows it but them. And guess who comes and saves them at times like this in need? Taurus, it's you. This person could be broke without with emotions. They could be broken with someone to come, you know, and, and make them feel stable. And it could be money. It could be all kinds of things. But to you from someone, they're sending negative energy and. And I don't know what that and is, okay? I don't know what that and is, Taurus. Maybe you guys would know, okay? I only need you 
you in my life. Yeah, somebody wants to control you. They only need you in their life. And this person's starting to see that all these other people that they thought were better than you and that they need to put on this big old huge facade and shit like that, they ain't worth shit. New love wants to add to you. Taurus, what you gonna do? Someone here from your past wants you to be in their life only. They only need you what they claim and the new love wants to add to you so someone wants to take here and someone wants to add hmm Taurus that is merely that is merely up to you my loves but I think I kind of know what the answer should be why did it take all why did all this take place love isn't felt like it used to you hurt me so Taurus I think that you're really you're really stepping out of the box here and you're you're explaining to somebody just how much they hurt you you wanted to know why did all this take place. Like I said before, Taurus, I feel that this all took place because the Most High God, um, Spirit, Universe, they have a plan here. Someone did. Someone fucking dropped the bomb. They failed the test miserably. You were bought into someone's life for a reason and they missed the damn train. They were given many signs and warnings, okay? This person still send negative energy. I feel like it's warning. I feel like it's a warning. You know, I send negative energy to you and like, it's like, and you need to stop. That's probably what spirit's trying to say. First card that came out, Taurus, is Earth sign. That's you, my loves. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You could be dealing with another uh, Earth sign. It's possible, Taurus, okay? Take time to be who you truly are equals happiness. So you being who you truly are, you wanting to do the things, you manifesting the things that you want to do with this person. You know, when you gave too much too soon, you actually let this person kind of understand that, oh, wow. Taurus will support me. Taurus will do everything I want them to do. All I got to do is play nice. Hi, Taurus. This person, like, tries to act very sweet. But you always shine so bright. They do not like it. That's why they send negative energy towards, even when you were with this person, they were sending negative energy to you. It could be just thoughts. It could be them just sitting there wanting to hurt you on purpose. But all I miss is within you, Taurus. Everything that they miss is within you. Too much too soon. You see? That's why they miss everything within you, because you gave too much. Now, if you didn't give this person as much as you did, I'm not saying they wouldn't miss you, but it kind of would have been a less heartbreaking for you. But I still feel deep inside that Taurus is heartbreaking. It was meant to happen because it grew you, Taurus. Whether you want to admit that shit or not, I feel it through my bones. Spirit's telling me something grew you here. You've outgrown this motherfucker, and that's what they are scared of. Their worst fear is coming to the motherfucking light because they treated you so much like shit, and they want a reward for that. You got me... <laughs> I think Spirit's saying you got them effed up. They didn't think you had a spiritual team, Taurus. They didn't think you was going to be protected. Well, rebuilding my confidence, Taurus, and that's exactly what you're doing. Rebuilding your confidence. But you know what? I don't think you have to do too much of rebuilding because some new love here wants to add to you, Taurus. They want to add to you. They don't want to deplete you, okay? They want to add to you. Do you know how magnificent and beautiful that is, Taurus, to have somebody come into your life and want to add things to you instead of ripping things from you? That is amazing, complete, beautiful transformation here. You went from some using ass, I said negative bullshit, I'm broke and no one knows it, I need to satisfy, and you can't shine better than me, you know, blah, 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 to somebody at the end here, Taurus. New love wants to add to you. Absolutely gorgeous. Cross watchers, you can thumbs down me all the fuck you want. This is beautiful energy. You snoozed and you motherfucking lost, and that's exactly what you deserve can decide you him or her look at this bullshit somebody's still indecisive Taurus it doesn't matter they're still indecisive but they want to come around and act like you're the only one for them Taurus why because you have something that they they, they know you have kind-heartedness love compassion nurturing they need that while you're building your confidence and feeling better about yourself here they come I only need you in my life can't decide you him or her it could be either one okay it doesn't matter gender's not very much so i put him you or her whatever some people don't even like labels okay do whatever it is you like to do i wish this did not happen i'm so lost i'm sure you are i'm sure you are pookie i'm sure you are lost because guess what everything this person sends to you blows away it's ash. That's what it is. They send it and it looks like a big old huge gift and they think it's working and then it gets sent to you and then it gets blown the fuck away. It's not even in your energy, Taurus. You might be feeling the gist of it, like a little bit of, you know, in this uncertainty and stuff like that. Spirit will let people do things like that just so they can sit there and exercise what this person's really going to do. Spirit gives people the opportunity to treat you like shit or to see if they can actually do better. This person's not doing better. 
they want you to come and do better for them, okay? They're not doing better. They see you doing and rebuilding your confidence for yourself, and they do not like it. You always shine so bright. Well, there's a problem there, Taurus. See? You always shine so bright, Spirit. Clarify that. Passionate, hot. This makes somebody hot for you, Taurus, yet they are a bit jealous, okay? They are a bit jealous of it. Let's see. You always shine so bright. <laughs> I want to have sex with you. No one compares. Damn, Taurus. So you got somebody turned on here, okay? And if you are having sexual in intercourse or anything with anybody else, please, this is not a channel for children. Just back the fuck out, okay? I don't want to talk about it. Um, this person's jealous. I don't know why I felt the jealousy in this. You should always shine so bright. And then here at the end, we're building your confidence. A new love wants to add to you. So, of course, Taurus, if there's new love that wants to add to you, you and somebody else is going to be making some good love, okay? making good love and this person fucked up okay they fucked up this person let their desires and shit get to them i tend to build my character and security on and off others okay now dry your eyes today start living for yourself no one else there you are tort if you're feeling that okay this person tends to build off of other people okay but spirit's saying dry your eyes dry your eyes today taurus Start living for yourself, no one else. It's time for you to live for you. Though this person might come in with a lot of passion and hotness, Taurus, I don't see love here. I don't see actually wanting to add and give you same, uh, let's, 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 let's uh, give and take with each other. Let's share each other's love. Let's share each other's um, dreams and aspirations and let's come in t together and build. No, I see. Well, I'm going to throw negative shit at you because you haven't came running back to me like my ego wants you to. So now that I'm bruised and I feel a bit hurt because now you have actually found out who the fuck I really am, I'm going to just send you negative energy. You gave this person too much too soon, Taurus, and all they wanted was passion and sex. <laughs> to you from, to you from. Okay. Okay, gossip, talk too much. So this person spreads a lot of things about you, okay? They send this negative energy to you, and it's from someone. You know who this is, Taurus, who gossips a lot. This person gossips a lot. Not good, negative vibes and energy. Not good, negative vibes and energy, okay? So we got this We got this here, the gossip too much, and then the negative energy. That's not good. And I send negative energy to you and, okay? I was clarifying to you from... Okay, and it could be a fire sign, Taurus, that you're dealing with, Leo, Aries, Sag, or they might have it somewhere in their chart. Okay, so, yeah, I kind of felt that that wasn't really drained, sensitive, and conditioned out, but can't take it. So, somebody can't take the fact, Taurus, that you're moving forward. There's some new love here, Taurus. Let's get out the tarot. There's some new love here. Can I borrow you from the night? Swear, oh, sneak away with me. Take a bath. <laughs> you guys, when I see that people actually cheat on somebody that they're already with or if they're already in connection, they're basically exchanging, you know, intimacy. So when I find out somebody like is actually trying to like, you know, do something on the DL with another person and sneaking away, I just think nasty. The juices being exchanged and stuff. You a nasty motherfucker, man. And mine is not being shared with nothing but one person. Look, I ain't got time to be sitting up in no clinic trying to find out if you don't gave me some the clap and shit. Nah. Again, 18 and under. Out the fuck out. Okay? This is so the grown. That's it. Grown ups, you know, okay? You know. And if you got a problem with this talk to, exit the fuck out. Ain't nobody making you stay. Go on ahead and thumbs down me on the way out. This is for the grown people. Okay, uh, that's what I like to do is talk with grown folks. I don't sit around kids all day and talking with them. Now, my children, we talk about Bob the Builder and shit quite often. But <laughs> Look, man, y'all say, let me just stop. Let me just stop. Spirit, give us three cards here for my dear collective of Tauruses. Give us three cards that they need to be aware of, Spirit. What do they need to be aware of? What do you need them to see? Show them what they need. My kids, oh, my Taurus is out there playing with the girls. He keeps them occupied. Oh, wow. Family, home, and commitment, Taurus. You're going towards this. This new love that wants to add to you. Wow. 
Yeah, after all that you've been through. CC Taurus, look at this. Somebody here is so passionate and hot because you shine so brightly. But somebody actually wants to build a home and commitment and family with you. Okay, I'm going to put that there. I just feel strongly, intuitively that I need to put that there, Taurus. I don't know why Spirit had me do another Taurus reading today. I don't know why. I just felt the need that I needed to share this with you guys. Huh? Spirit, what else would you like Taurus to know? One more. One more, Spirit. What would you like Taurus to know? What do they need to see? What do they need to see toward us, uh, Spirit? Okay. Yeah, a union. A union. Not a reunion. A union, Taurus. Something, someone that mixes with you. Like, not somebody manipulative. You could be dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. This is Ace of Water in the reverse. This is like the Ace of Cups to me in the reverse, okay? Look at right underneath that. Toxicity, bound, and patterns. This toxic-ass person, this manipulative-ass person, they love the passion, but they don't want to put in the real work to be with you, Taurus. They don't. And you used to long for this person. You used to long for them in se separation. They don't want to be separated no more, and they're longing for you, Taurus. They're longing about this separation. And why? It's because they need... They, it's, you're about to harvest something, Taurus. Look at this, look, Taurus. Look what I'm... Listen, baby, look what I'm, look at this, look at this. If you don't even, if you don't res resonate with nothing here, you shouldn't be here. If you do, look at, babe, look what I'm talking about here. Ace of water, ace of cups in the reverse, and then toxicity bound in patterns and longing and separation in the reverse. Somebody is very highly manipulative and they only want to keep you bound to them. With the same fucking patterns that they do before. Like I said, when this person comes, the party ain't jumping anymore with these other motherfuckers. So, I only need you in my life. And then over here, you always shine so bright. All I see is like sex and sweat. That's all I see. Which, Taurus, I know you guys might think that's good. But, I mean, for the short term, of course. But then somebody gonna go around and gossip about you, okay? To you from someone. They send gossip about you to you, okay? And then send negative energy and, and not good negative vibes and energy. That came out on its own. And then a fire sign here. Somebody might have fire sign in their chart or you could be an Aries Taurus Cusper. It doesn't matter. But look at this. Look at this and then look at this. You got some love coming in, Taurus, okay? Let me put this down for you, babe, so you can see. Gotta make sure my babies can see. Yeah, Taurus, y'all my babies. Y'all are. I love you guys so much. I do. Not only because my Taurus is a, uh, my fiance is a Taurus, but I love you guys' energy. My daughter's a Taurus. My daughter-in-law is a Taurus. Um, my sister is a Taurus. Yes. Beautiful, beautiful energy you guys carry. Um, this new love that wants to add to you, they want the home, family, and commitment, and it's a union that's meant to be bought to get to the... What's going on up here is trying to clutch its way into this. It's trying to cause a divide here. Why? Because this person is highly manipulative. They don't know how to be any other way. They're toxic and they want to bound, bound you to them with the same negative patterns. It'll all start again. And you both in separation, this person doesn't want that anymore. Because this toxicity is like really, really strong. And then this hot sex and things, that's all that's there to offer. This person can only offer sex. I don't, I don't think family home and commitment and a, and a, I don't think that that's what they're offering that's why things they send your way they turn into ashes and they blow away I wish this did not happen I'm so lost they're lost without you Taurus because you allowed this person to bring toxicity in you allow them to manipulate you you also made this person believe that you were just a naive person like you didn't know what the fuck was going on like you can't see things for yourself here's another card Taurus oh somebody's still in their okay comfort zone clinging Somebody's still clinging to you, Taurus, because guess what? You comfort them. No matter what shady bullshit they do to you, you would always be the one to come running and comfort them or they would come running to you. And they're clinging. I see the stuff on this lady's face and I can't help to think but, uh, okay, you know what? Let me just, let me just shut the fuck up because then my page will be reported for some shit. I mean, damn. I'm going to have to do a grown and sexy type of reading, okay, for grown-ups. I'm going to have to make a membership club or something where we can just talk and be free. And because I, I know no haters going to spend money to come be in a, in a member in a group for members only. I need to figure something out because I like talking with adults. Like I like talking about adult things, man, man, shit. We all do it. It's human fucking nature. Okay. It's human. 
Why do people got to be so dense about talking about it? Oh, no, I don't want to hear that talk. Man, please, gone. Get out of here. There's other readers that won't talk about it. They don't even want to. And that's fine. But me, uh -uh, I'm a different type of breed, man. I'm a Leo. And let me tell you something. Let me tell y'all something. A Leo has a very, very good way of expressing Okay, yeah, they say that we're loyal and they we get a bad rep. Oh, we want to shine brighter. We like attention. This Leo right here, motherfuckers, does not like attention. I keep my ass in black clothing. I want to be kept to myself. I don't got no motherfucking friends. I don't need them. These days, they don't... <laughs> my family's my friend. Okay, let me tell y'all. My family's my friend. Y'all, yeah, you being detached from somebody here, Taurus, is making them more attracted to you. Mm-hmm. Like I said, this person goes only after hot, steamy things, okay? They only go after hot, you know, hot passion and chemistry. They like to sexually um, exchange energies with different people because it's fun. Like, they're like a, a nympho, okay? There's nothing wrong with liking it, but this person does it with different people. And your ancestral guides, the, the power that you have, Taurus, is trying to show you that this person's always going to have somebody else involved, external people, you know, they're showing you, like, the, it, your ancestors, okay? Your ancestor your ancestor guides are trying to help you understand that you are able to manifest exactly what it is you want. But Taurus, if you do not want to be attached to someone that's only attracted to you for sex, they're giving you the ability to actually manifest what it is you really want without external parties and shit. Like, it feels like this person likes to go out and drink. Okay, which is all cute and sweet, but if you have a man or a woman at home, why the fuck are you out in the streets with different people every night? I wouldn't trust you. Change and courage is in the reverse. They don't have the strength or the courage to change like you, Taurus. They're just not strong enough, and they're very, very rude. They come off very, very, um, you know, like, I, I don't have to give any nurture. I don't have to nurture shit. It nurtures me. Like, this person is just, ugh. No, oh, Taurus, no, my friends. Like, you could do so much better. I think Spirit's trying to tell you that. All right, let's get into the tarot, the tarot, the tarot. Okay, let's get into the tarot so I can let you guys go. Spirit's like, Lauren, Lauren, tap, tap, Lauren, Lauren. <laughs> yeah, look, somebody tried, somebody's trying to fastly approach you because they want a brand new beginning that's not going to even work. They had something. They ran towards something that was not even. It looked like gold. Okay, look at this. They tried coming in passionately. They running now because things are slowing down from this person that they're dealing with. These people. They're running from something now. Be very mindful of that, my dear Torians. Yep. And this is the fucking truth. It's the swords and upright, and the and the knight of wands and the upright. They running right into their damn clarity. They 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 gonna see today. Okay. Or some playing no motherfucking games, bro. I ain't playing. I ain't playing with you. Okay, let's see. Spirit, what do you have for my dear collective Taurus this spirit? Let's just get some cards out here and see what's going on, spirit. It'll take me forever to clean all this up, guys, and then start bringing out the tarot. So, look, I'll just do it all at the end. Oh, King of Wands. Somebody that sleeps with everybody. That's what I see my King of Wands as, okay? Um, yeah, if you don't see it that way, hey, good for you. But this person's so insecure, okay? They can actually be someone smart and have, um, you know, uh, confidence, but they don't. They go around showing that they're old, they're handsome, they're pretty, they got this, they got that. They ain't got a motherfucking thing but insecurities for you, okay? And then when they come along, they cling to your beautiful energy to make you feel just like they do. Insecure, okay? Toxic, you know? I long for Taurus because Taurus is beautiful and vibrant and beautiful and you know and very confident now we're building your confidence taurus that's what you're doing my loves you look so good doing it taurus okay please understand that don't let this person tell you different that's their that's their agenda is to say look taurus they're so upset and so ill confident because like i said y'all dealing with a fire sign here somewhere i mean shit fire sign came out some of you are taurus not all of you not all of you my loves not all of you but the King of Wands in the reverse here with the Two of Wands in the upright, somebody's really watching you move forward into another direction, okay? This person right here has their hand, 
<laughs> their fist. Okay, look, Taurus. Look at this this dude or woman. Look at that. That little ball fist. Of like, God damn it. Like, you know, just mad. Because you're going in another direction, but it's making them extra angry. Yeah. Look. Aries energy down here. A lot of you might be Aries, Taurus, Cuspers. But you are making a decision to move the other direction. Look at this. Look at that. You're going towards this way. And this person's like sitting here. Do you see that? Torres, Torres, Torres. Who the fuck's calling me? Yeah, thank you. Go away. Okay. What do you got here, Spirit for Taurus? Four of Wands in the reverse. You leave in an unhappy situation, Taurus. Somebody would sit there and put the blinders on you to make you feel like you was in a great connection. There's a lot of fire energy here. Some of you could be done with the Leo Aries Sag, or it could just be in your chart, Taurus. And this is what, you know. Don't have to be a fire sign, you all. You could be a water sign, an earth sign, air sign. Doesn't matter, loves. You're carrying the energy. This is what we're reading is the energy. Four of Wands in the reverse, my loves. Okay. Now, if you look at this, the two of Wands here with these four of Wands is the six of Wands. Okay. Even though one is upside down, two of them are up. You are going to be successful here. Okay. You're going to get to where you're wanting to get to. Somebody can cling to you all they want. They'll be doing the clinging. You'll be doing the letting go. And then they'll be stuck there, manipulating themselves, basically. Okay, they want to keep sending you negative energy and negative vibes, but I don't think this person understands what they're doing. They're racking up their own damn karma. Like, why would somebody look? Ten of Cups in the reverse. Some of them is uh, family members that are very unhappy with your progress, okay? I feel like it's an ex though involved here somewhere. Somebody from your past. Yeah, you weren't happy with them. Spirit, what else would you have for my collective choices? What else would you like my beautiful Taurians to know? Please, Spirit, connect. Connect. Thank you. Yeah, Taurus, somebody wants to come and apologize for making your life a living hell. I'm so sorry, Taurus. Here's a tiny fish that isn't fried, but I would like you to have it. My emotions run so deep. So deep, in fact, Taurus, that this person's still clinging to you. They still want to be manipulative, and they still are toxic. They're longing to close with you, so they're going to come in with a page energy. Okay, they're going to come with the page energy, though they have the actions of the king of the wands in the reverse. They act very childish. They're very, um, you know, the page of cups. They, they, this person like talks really sweet to you, Taurus, but behind them, they're pissed. They're insecure. And this makes an unhappy co connection. It makes it unhappy. It makes it unstable. It's like, no, like, are you, are you kidding me? No, Taurus, that's toxicity. That's bound. That's patterns. There's a pattern here. I'm mad. You're you're better. You know, I feel that you're better. This is what this person feels. I'm no good. You're going to try to move into another direction. Oh, my God. You're on your phone, Taurus. What the fuck are you doing? Um, you know, oh, my gosh. Throw things around. Call you names. Do whatever they want. Whoop-de-whoop. All that stuff. You know, hoop de ha hoop de day and all that. You know, oh, fuck you. Fuck your mom. All that. Taurus, I'm not saying F your mom. What I'm stating here is this, this person has a fucked up mouth. And then here they come back with Page of Cups. Here's the fish that I didn't fry or cook, but you go on ahead and cook it. At least I gave it to you. No, Taurus. What energy else do we have for Taurus spirit? Yeah, King of Swords, you're cutting this shit out. I don't want your apology, ho. I don't want any of it, okay? I don't want your apology. I'm cutting all these patterns and this toxic bound and patterns bullshit with your manipulative clinging ass. I want to go towards somebody that's going to give me a family home and commitment. A serious, beautiful union. Okay? Something. I'm rebuilding my confidence. You can't even decide if you want to be with him, her, or whoever. You ain't going to tell me that, though. But, Taurus, they're telling me. Spirit's letting me know what this person's about. Now, again, if this ain't, your, if this ain't you, it ain't you. Yeah. Look. They want to put down the juggling for right now, Taurus. That's what I see that as, the two of pentacles in reverse. I don't see somebody balanced. I see somebody that needs to actually have a permanent balance. Because if it was a permanent balance, it was something that was stable, they wouldn't be out, this car wouldn't be out here at all, reverse or upright. It wouldn't come out at all. Okay, let's just get, um, you're cutting all this out, all this out. These negative patterns, yeah. Six of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Somebody that just likes to share with everybody. They're feeling left out in the cold now, Taurus. They went from the six to the five. Because you dropped out. That's what you did. You dropped out. Oh, you want to share with the whole hook? Oh, you want to be a hoe? Okay. I'm going to put a hoe where it needs to go. Outside. doesn't need to belong in my in, in my life. I, I can't turn a hoe into a housewife. I just simply can't. 
I can't turn it in. I can't turn you into a wife or a husband if you're going to do this to me. You know, you portray that you want this with me, but behind my back, you're giving other people and then have me wait. Look at that girl sitting there just waiting her turn. No, Taurus, and no, neither do you want to. You don't have to and you don't want to. Fuck all that. Put this motherfucker out in the cold and leave them where they need to be at. That's where hoes stand. They, they go outside and they scroll. They walk around. Yeah, look at this. They feel left out in the cold of a connection that could have been something nice, but Taurus, y'all ended it. This, this is an ending here. There's a connection that could have been something strong, but it didn't turn strong. It turned weaker by the second. Okay? This looks like it's summertime here, and now it's wintertime. Here we go, Taurus. The winter's coming. Now this person's coming back to show. Oh, I'm so sorry. It's cuffing season now. You know, summertime, they want to be all up in other people's faces and not really give connection, give the attention to your connection. Now it's getting cold outside. This hose at your door. Help me. Help me. I'm broke and no one knows it. Oh, you shine so bright. Passionate. Hot. Taurus. Hot your ass out my motherfucking porch. Get away from my DMs. Don't come back. Don't come back. This is not a whole hotel. This is not what this is, Taurus. Yeah, and now they're stressed out about it. The Nine of Swords. Now they're stressed out and sad. This person's not getting sleep, Taurus. They're not getting sleep. But guess what? They, they abuse their privilege. They abuse their power. They know you love them to the moon and back. They knew what they had. They knew how much you gave them. Again, too much, too soon. It gave this person plenty of opportunity to fuck you over. And now, look where they're at. Let's get a uh, clarifying on this family, home, commitment, and union spirit. Can we get a clarifier on this family, home, commitment, and union? Okay, can we get um, a clarifier on this family, home, commitment, and union? Oh, wow. The Empress in the reverse. Someone doesn't want you to have it, Taurus. They don't want you to grow. Like I said before in the reading, if you need to rewind it, go on ahead. I said that someone's trying to get in between this. They don't want this Empress to grow. They don't want you to be your true self because they know that you're marriage material. They know that you're spiritual material. They know that you're husband material, that you're wife material, that you are family material, but they don't want to give you the family and the love you deserve. They want to bring you into a toxic, bound, and controlling, clinging kind of connection. But Taurus, you know what that does to you. Four of Wands in the reverse. They won't be successful doing so, Taurus. This person's dying for your attention. They want it. They want it now. And they're not going to get it. Okay? So, they might want to sit there and, and not have you grow. They might send negative energy your way. But, Taurus, they're not going to... They're not going to win here. This is not a winning or lose situation. It's like both parties have lost. Because... You're not trying to fucking play any games, but they want to make sure that they make you play. Do you see what I'm saying? So there's no one's winning here. It's like, what? It's like me getting in a car. Like, you know, sometimes you're at the red light and stuff, and people are sitting there looking at you, and then when the light turns green, they want to race you. It's like, the fuck are you doing? Like, <laughs> it's a race. I don't care what nobody say. I feel it in my bones when they do that. It's like a race it's like against time or something. Like, what are you doing, bruh? There's so many cars up there with their brake lights hitting right now. You think you're going to race me? Anyway, nine of wands at the bottom of the deck in the reverse, okay? Three of swords in the upright, Taurus. This is what's going on here. You're done dealing with third parties and heartbreak. They're just starting. They're just starting, okay? Because that third party, whatever it was, Taurus, they thought was going to be better than you. It did not work out. It's not working out. You're letting go. You're done. You're done. Okay? You're letting this all go. And then you're going to go into that great, beautiful family home and commitment that you've always wanted. You've always wanted Taurus to feel a part of something. Something bigger than you. Something bigger than, you know, something bigger than uh, life itself. Something that made you feel complete. You know what I mean? And somebody's heartbroken over this when you were right there in front of them the whole time. You just decided, look, I can't take any more mistreatment. I'm going on to something else. And they're upset about that. Yeah, and they don't want you to grow. They don't want you to go anywhere. They don't want you to accept Taurus. This is your card, okay? 
Taurus, the Empress in the reverse with the Six of Wands in the reverse. Someone does not want you to grow nor be successful. They don't want you to grow with someone new and they want you to give them attention that you're not giving them. Again, Taurus, someone does not want you to grow and they don't want you to be successful. They don't want anything to grow outside but with them and they don't want you to, they, they need your attention here. Someone wants your attention so bad. And when you give this person the attention, Taurus, you end up lacking yourself, your power. You give all that up to give this person attention because they're clingy. Do any more messages? They're clingy. King of Cups. Taurus, yeah, you're very, very, um, queen or king of cups, you're very, very solid in your emotions. You're very laid back. You're not, you're not giving this person any type of reaction that they're wanting. They want you to be over emotional and crazy and, and running out and throwing stuff around and throwing up weird things on, 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 you know, the book and stuff and just saying ugly things. And it's not happening, Taurus. And you not doing that, Taurus, puts this person more and more into a deep, low self-esteem their their self-esteem is so low yeah it's so low Taurus that they feel that they need to try and take yours seven of seven of swords in the upright if you look how she's looking back at this you know she's looking back at herself okay she's leaving two swords there but at the same time this person remembers when you lacked self-love okay and strength to be yourself because you always wondered what they would think here they come sneaking back in but this, this old ball-headed bitch or guy doesn't even look in front of him. Bitch, I'm already, I'm, I'm already protected. I already got things going in my favor. So what are you trying to take from me that you're not going to take? Have you even looked in front? Have you even, this girl here, she hasn't even looked in front of her. She's so busy looking back, trying to confuse you and take your energy and your strength and confidence away. Remember, rebuilding your confidence is here. She's so busy looking back at that and hasn't even looked in front of her. <laughs> Surprise, bitch. <laughs> I'm sitting at the top of the wheel. It's going to wheel down here. Whee! Right in my favor. Right in my favor. Right in my favor. That's what's going to happen here. Wow. Absolutely beautiful energy. And if you look down here, there's somebody else that's like looking up. But they're still on the wheel. Things will turn and eventually these two will meet. And it'll be a destined energy between you and another person. Because this person's so sneaky, trying to get on the wheel, trying to get on the wave with you, but they're not qualified, Taurus. They're not qualified, okay? They're not qualified to get on that wheel with you. But may I give you, uh, Taurus, um, spirit guides are carrying you into something more calmer. Your, your emotions and things are getting set, okay? Yeah, you're getting towards your nine of cups. Okay, and somebody's still five of swords. We just saw the five, the seven of swords. Yeah, someone's still trying to win over everything that you got going on. So, Taurus, be very careful as you're going into something more, your style, something more for you, family, home, commitment, a beautiful union, someone that wants to add to you. Someone's going to want your attention badly, and they want to take your power away from you to give them. That, that will make them feel, you know, victorious because you shine too bright. They don't want to share that spotlight with you. They want it to just be them. So be very careful of that, Taurus, okay? Let's get out some energy um, messages from the guides, and then we're going to close out the reading, my loves. I don't know why. I was. I, I felt that this, someone needed to hear this. Someone needed to hear this, okay? Now, again, if it's not your story or if it's not something you're dealing with, it's okay. It's okay. Even if a lot of you know this person for a very long time, that's why it's so hard for you to believe that they would do this shit, but... You guys, not everybody, Taurus, has the same kind heart as you. And you got to stop looking at people all having the same kind of heart because they don't. These people are jealous, okay? And when you're shedding skin, when you're shedding skin, when a snake sheds skin, they're just shedding skin, okay? They're still a fucking snake. That does not change. Just because they leave old skin behind doesn't mean that they're willing to change. They're slithering their ass right back into your energy. They're trying to sneak back into your life. Spirit said, fuck no. Okay, no, it's not going to work out. Sorry. Mm -mm. Spirit, what's for Taurus here? What would you like Taurus to know? Angel guys, what would you like Taurus to know? One more. What would you like Taurus to know? One more. I don't think so. Not here. Not today. No. 
The Five of Swords came out with the Seven of Swords on the back of this deck. It's something you're not seeing, Taurus. Pay attention. Open up, okay? Open up your eyes and see it for what it is. Not what you want it to be, okay? That's how that hurt came about the first time. That's how these people were, uh, were able to, like, you know, get their way with you, okay? You were just so kind-hearted and loving and wanting to make sure everybody else was doing good. But, Taurus, now that you're making sure you're doing you, here they come back to make sure you do them before you do yourself. Again, the same love. The same love, Taurus. This is control, okay? If somebody doesn't have it, then they feel lost. I guess Spirit only has one message for you, love. Okay, okay, Spirit, okay, okay. Know your truth is at the bottom of the deck. Spirit's at least going to give me that. Know your truth, okay? Know your truth, Taurus. Know it. First card that came out, Taurus. Oh, oh I don't like my cards. <laughs> Guys, I get so upset when they start moving around. Like, I just want them all spread it out. Look, is that look? No, some of them kind of look crooked, Taurus, but come on. Live your bliss. Know your truth. Live your bliss. Know your truth. Absolutely beautiful energy to close us out, Taurus. You know what your truth is for many of you. You're coming into union with someone new. And you, some of you are afraid to take that first step towards something new because something from the past is trying to stop you. All I miss is what's, it's within you, Taurus. You gave too much to this person too soon, Taurus. They saw too much. But guess what? That's their karma to have to wake up every day, okay, and know that you're doing better. Uh, to go to sleep every night, know that you're going to be just sleeping just fine. This person tries to connect with you in different ways, Taurus, to try to get your attention. It's not working, okay? They're imbalanced. They're broke, okay? They don't want you to grow, the Empress in the Reverse. They don't want you in your power, and they don't want you succeeding. They do not want people seeing you in the bright light. They don't. They want to come in, and they want to cause disharmony. They want to cause toxicity, uh, binding, and bound to them. And uh, It's sick energy, Taurus. Get out. Know your truth and live your bliss. Okay? And your bliss was not with this person. That was all a facade. They wanted to play you, Taurus, but they played themselves. Big time. Big time. Look at this. I'm holding on to this connection. I do not want you with anyone else. That's not up to them, Taurus. That's up to you. I love you guys so very much, Torians. Thank you for joining me for another reading, okay? I was called to do this reading, and I um, thank you guys for being here and listening, okay? Um, again, there's anything you need to know, it's down in the description box. I'm so grateful for you guys being here. I'm so grateful for the donations, the love, all of that, Taurus. Thank you so much. I greatly appreciate it. If you need anything, okay, please reach me at JustSmileTarot at gmail.com. JustSmileTarot at gmail.com, okay? Love you guys with all my heart. Many hugs and many kisses. Mwah, mwah. Bye, Taurus.